Hi, my name is Dr. Ben Gardea, and today I wanted to address a question we frequently get in dentistry. And that's the question, my teeth don't hurt, do I really need to come see a dentist? And just like in medicine, in dentistry there are a lot of conditions that don't cause pain, um, but they can still be a major issue. And today I wanted to show you some pictures of a case of just that situation. So this is a patient of mine who we saw just a few weeks ago. She's a young patient, uh, late teens, 17, 18. Um, she's never had any real pain or problems with these teeth um, that we're going to show you. But when she came in uh, just a few weeks ago, we found some rather deep decay. And we took the opportunity to take some pictures and, and share this situation with you. So these two teeth were the ones that we did that day. We don't have any pictures here of this one once the decay was removed. But here we can see, you know, she thought she maybe had a little cavity here because of some darkness that she could see on the tooth. But once we opened it up, um, we can see how much that decay spread around. And what you're seeing in this pink is what we call um, caries detector. We use this to help guide us. Uh, once, sometimes once you think the decay is all gone, it can, there can still be a little bit there. So this was a situation where we removed most of the decay. We went ahead and applied the caries detector just to see what was there. And we can see, see there's still a significant amount of caries hiding um, up under these little areas and then s s a small amount of decay here as far as the depth. But you can see how widespread it is. And what we see here in the center of this is actually the pulp. Um, so this is the nerve of the tooth that has the blood vessels and everything else. And this is a situation where the patient never had any pain whatsoever and now is in need of a root canal. Um, the, the sad thing about this is if the patient had been a little more consistent with her, with her care, this would have been a simple filling, you know, maybe a couple years ago and it would have been no big deal. But at this point she's going to have to have a root canal done or if she opts, possibly lose the tooth. So this is a very good example of why just because it doesn't hurt doesn't mean that you don't need to come in and, and have a dental exam and have a cleaning and really take care of your, your teeth really well at home. Um, so thanks for listening today and I hope that that's a little bit of helpful information there.